thank you for returning to my channel, Anthracite Horror Stories. And this particular video, I'm just going to be showcasing a pretty standard piece of equipment in the Anthracite coal field. This is a five ton anthracite coal car. This one's been restored. These people actually do sell bad coal and uh, I don't know if they sell loose coal, uh, but they sell uh, quick job here. This is in Jenkins Township, right along River Road. And here's the mighty Susquehanna, East Street Bridge, and just upstream. About a mile that way is the Knox coal mine disaster. So I don't know where this coal car came from. Up that way is a former Pennsylvania colliery. I don't know if that was the number 14. Down there is Knox, over there is Ewan, and then beyond that was the Butler. And they were all Pennsylvania coal companies. So uh, this is welded here, number 286. I saw other Pennsylvania coal company cars have that weld on it. This is a five-ton coal car that's restored. These are becoming more rare, obviously, as every year that goes by. And the kid was over there, along the river, right over there. It's the same coal car I was thinking. And unfortunately, they get 10 feet of water here. So this thing has been underwater more than once. I hope, unfortunately, when the river comes back up, it's an inevitability that this doesn't get dragged away. Uh, pretty good restoration, good woodwork. So each one of these wheels weighs 105 or 115 pounds, I, I can't remember. That's not even the axle and that's not the other wheel included, that's just the actual wheel itself. That's a pretty cool car. I'll show you the construction bit more closely. Of course it's raining. It's a dreary few months of weather here in Northeast Pennsylvania. That's a nice car. You don't see too many of these. Not many at all. Pretty cool out there. Unfortunately, on some of my future disaster videos, you'll hear about these running down slopes and runaway coal cars killing people. So you could imagine five ton of coal, five ton, each ton being 2,000 pounds, that's 10,000 pounds. I don't know what the topping, they would make the coal miners top above this metal line of the car, X amount of inches to X amount of feet. Um, so that would undoubtedly add weight to, to the five ton. So it could be more than 10,000 pounds of coal. These are decep deceivingly bigger than you would think. Show my Honda for comparison here. <clears throat> Get a shot with the car. So that gives you an idea how big it is. An SUV there. <clears throat> Size of a small compact car almost. Thank you for viewing this and be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already.